everyone! Welcome back to my channel. My name is Haley, and today we are talking about things you need to bring with you to college. So I am going to be an incoming junior in college in September, so I've been around the block a couple times of what you should bring with you to your dorm. So yeah, let's just get started. So I made another video similar to this last summer. So if you wanna go check it out, I'll have it linked in the description or up above here if you wanna watch that video. But today I'm just gonna be telling you some more things I think are important for you to bring with you to college. So the first thing I think is super, super, super important is bringing a Brita water filter. Um, personally, uh, for me where I lived, I didn't have access to a water fountain nearby, like in my dorm area, so we used a Brita water filter, filled it up with sink water, filtered the water, and then we had clean drinking water to drink from so we could stay hydrated. Um, for us, the closest water fountain was probably the dining hall, which was kind of far away to be honest. So it was kind of out of the way, um, like in the morning before classes. So. I definitely suggest a Brita water filter if you do not want to fill up at a water bottle station. Um, of course, this depends on like where you are, but it was very handy to have in our dorm so we didn't have to leave or go anywhere. It was just in our mini fridge. So yeah, I think a Brita water filter is super important. The next thing is kind of to each their own, but the next thing I would say is to bring a rug for your dorm. Um, a lot of dorms can be cold and feel dark, so I suggest bringing a rug to brighten the like room and make it more fuzzy. My room had gross floors. We cleaned them I don't know how many times. The floor was just disgusting. So I got a rug and put it by my bed so it kind of covered most of the floor. My rug did get kind of dirty but over the summer I vacuumed it and washed it and got it as clean as I could so I'm still using it now. It's in my apartment so I definitely think a rug is important if you don't want your dorm to feel so dark or cold. Also, I didn't want my feet on the bare dorm floor, so yeah, I, I didn't want to touch that. So I think a rug, for me at least, was super important, um, yeah. The next thing I would recommend is a desk lamp. So for me last year with my desk, there was already a light underneath my desk, like it was installed in the desk. So I didn't need a desk lamp. But this year when I moved to my apartment, I moved into an apartment that came already furnished. So um, it came with the bed and the desk and the dresser, but it didn't come with a light. So I got a desk lamp for my desk and it has done me wonders. It is so bright and I love it. I personally got mine from Ikea. I really like it. I'll put a picture here if I can find one, but I really liked it. It was really inexpensive and it did the job. But of course for my freshman year, a lamp already came installed with the desk. So it kind of depends on where you're going to college and like your situation. Maybe check your school like online, what your dorm comes with. If not, wait till you get to school and then buy one after you get there to see if you already have a lamp installed or not. But yeah, I definitely would say a desk lamp is super, super important. The next thing is kind of a given, at least for me it was. I had printed out a bunch of pictures of family and friends to hang in my dorm to make me not feel so far away from them. I had pictures all over my side of the room. Yeah, it made me feel not so alone that my parents and friends weren't so far away. And I had some of my favorite pictures of my family and it just made me feel so happy to have them on my wall and represent them. So for me, it was kind of a given that I wanted to have pictures in my room. Um, obviously, again, to each their own, but um, I feel like pictures really filled the space and having a collage wall really um, help design my room so I liked having pictures in my room. Alright the last thing that I think is super important to bring with you to your dorm is a long phone charger. Like a long one. For me I didn't need a long phone charger because my bed was like right next to an outlet which was super convenient but this year in my apartment the outlets are like super random and I have to use like an extension cord and a really long charging cord so I definitely recommend a long charger because it'll help you so much depending on your situation just to be safe because um, you don't really know until you get to school 
what the situation or layout of your dorm is going to be so i definitely recommend a long charger because you're gonna need it and especially if you like have bunk beds like i know my cousin she made her bed like up to a loft so she needed the long charging cord to go all the way up so i definitely recommend a long charger so those are all the things i'm going to be sharing with you today of what you need to bring with you to college like i said before i filmed a video like this last year so i'll have the link in the description if you want to check it out and also if you want to see a part three give this video a thumbs up so i know to find other things that you guys need to bring with you to college so yeah if you haven't already make sure to hit subscribe down below and also comment what you are most excited about for college so i hope you guys enjoy this video and i'll see you in my next one bye